This film must look very scary for people with claustrophobia. She is trapped in a tunnel full of traps and when she enters a strange place that looks like she is in the stomach. When she stretched out her hand, there was a mysterious creature outside. Then a collection of hands-like tentacles appeared and suddenly there was a human head shape that appeared towards her and she touched the mysterious creature. Lisa is a mother who has lost her daughter because of her negligence in taking care of her daughter and because of a broken heart. Lisa tried to commit suicide by lying on a road and when a car was about to come her way, Lisa then stood up again because she was still unsure. Then the car owner named Adam asked how Lisa was and offered Lisa a lift as it was getting dark, but Lisa refused. Shortly when the car left, Lisa then returned to stop the car and accept a ride. While on the way, Lisa heard all the news spread on the radio that there had been a murder case, and the perpetrator had the characteristics of a cross tattoo on his right hand. When Lisa saw Adam's right hand, she suddenly felt scared because Adam had a cross tattoo on his right hand. Lisa then tries to save herself, but it's too late. Adam then breaks suddenly and causes Lisa to hit her head unconscious. Lisa then wakes up in a place that looks like an iron box. A frightened Lisa tried to scream for help, but there was no response from outside. Then Lisa Lisa was back banging on the ceiling of the iron box trying to break it out but her efforts were in vain. Lisa then saw a bracelet on her hand that had a glow. Then Lisa tried to open a door using the bracelet but only in vain. When Lisa was sitting, not long after the small door suddenly opened, Lisa then entered the hole and also she saw on her wristband that there is a time running. It is not known what the function of the bracelet is. Then Lisa crawled back through the narrow passage but as she was crawling, the tunnel suddenly began to narrow and would have killed her if she didn't try to run away. Lisa started crawling quickly and luckily she managed to survive the trap. Lisa looked back at the time on her wristband. Lisa crawled again to escape from the tunnel. Soon she saw that there was human corpse blocking her. It seemed that there were several people who had tried to escape from the tunnel but failed and were killed. Lisa tried to move the body aside so she could go through the tunnel. When she was crawling through the tunnel suddenly an iron block her way. The iron was too strong and there was also a flamethrower coming out of the tunnel. Luckily a shelter opened up so Lisa could hide in that place. Fire then sprayed in the tunnel but Lisa survived. Then the shelter returned to its initial position. Lisa then crawled back and saw a hole filled with water. Lisa entered the water hole and passed the obstacle easily. And when she made it through the water barrier and headed into the tunnel again suddenly the water began to fill the tunnel. She also saw someone's corpse that was carried away by the water but luckily Lisa was still safe. Lisa came back on all fours and she saw the exposed floor filled with acid. Lisa passed that way with great care and she then found a dead end but she saw someone was in front of her who looked very desperate. Lisa tries to calm him down but then a secret door to shelter from the fire opens. Same room as before. They then scramble and fight to enter the room, and Lisa managed to fill the room stomping on the man's hand and as the door closed, the man's hand that was there was then cut off. I think they could have shared the room and survived but maybe because they panicked they had to fight over it. It turns out that the man is Adam, explaining that he is not the perpetrator behind this kidnapping. When Lisa saw Adam's hand, Suddenly a strange creature entered the place and began to heal Lisa's wounds. After finishing treating the wound, Lisa then continued her journey through the tunnel, and she saw a propeller was in front, then crawled as fast as possible backwards, and saw a door that was above open. Lisa managed to climb through the door without the slightest injury, but before she could rest, she saw a mysterious creature right behind. Lisa tried to move slowly, and when the creature started moving towards her, Lisa then quickly crawled to escape from the creature. After that Lisa found two doors in which she had to choose one of the doors without knowing which door was right. Lisa then chose a door at random and found herself in a white room. And the white room showed all the memories of her life. And she also saw her daughter while she was alive. Lisa is sad again because she feels like a mother who has failed to take care of her daughter. After seeing the mysterious creature was apparently still chasing her who was above her. Lisa resumed her walk and when Lisa entered the tunnel. She saw that the tunnel had barbed wire and saw that the time on the bracelet was running out. Lisa then quickly tried to pass through the wire even though the wire hurt her badly. But when the time was up Lisa just resigned not caring that she would die. And when the fire was spit out, 
Suddenly a floor below opened. Lisa survived and she is now in a metal box where she was in the beginning. A strange creature reappears from above healing her wounds. Lisa then realizes a code found in Adam's hand earlier is. The code to escape from this crazy tunnel. Which shows which way to go. Lisa then took advantage of her second chance to pass through the tunnel. When she got to a passage with a trap of acid liquid. Lisa has the idea to take off the bracelet in her hand to use the acid. After successfully removing the bracelet. Lisa saw a code on the back of her hand which had been covered by the bracelet earlier. And know which way to go. Lisa managed to get through all the obstacles very easily and even very quickly. She then enters a strange place that looks like she is in the stomach of a mysterious creature. When she saw a strange monster chasing her that meant there too. Lisa then tried to run away and hide in the shelter for a while. But then the door that blocked them opened again. Lisa was forced to fight a strange creature by stepping on the strange creature's head until it shattered. Lisa returned through the tunnel full of obstacles and entered the place where she met her daughter. Then her daughter asked Lisa to follow her but Lisa refused because Lisa felt that her daughter was not real and she had to proceed through the tunnel. Lisa then continued her journey and found a new obstacle that contained cutting irons. Lisa calculated how long it took for the cutting iron to appear and then go through it. One by one the cutting iron can be passed and at the last iron cutting, her foot was cut off but she didn't care because she had made it through all the obstacles. And when she felt she had made it out, it turns out the sky all she saw was just a trick. And Lisa was so desperate and didn't care that she was going to die. And suddenly the ceiling of the tunnel opened and she was lifted up by a very bright light. And when Lisa woke up she was on the rocks where there was a waterfall there. Lisa looked back at her daughter which was just a hallucination but then her daughter explained that Lisa had to live on. And it is also shown that Lisa is on a planet far from Earth. If you like this video don't forget to subscribe. Because by subscribing you have supported me to make better videos. What movie do you want next? Just comment below. Have a nice day.